Hi guys. I'll wait for some people to come on before we start communicating. Oh, you can send waves now. That's so cool. Hey, hey. What's up, guys? How has your weekend been so far? I know technically you only had your Friday night and now your Saturday morning, but. Last night, I got to go and see one of my best friends perform. It's her first tour and she's touring with J Balvin. So go Taylor Knight, she smashed it. She absolutely killed the show and I had Sam Holmberg come and fly out as well. And she hung out with me, it's been so great. I'm like nearing the end of my Atlanta days. I'm going back to Cali in three days. So it was good to like end, end this long trip with a bang. But I have my brother out here as well and Dana Vons was there. And shout out to Jay Balvin for getting us tickets. And Will and Janelle's choreo was so good. So shout out to them as well. It was just really amazing. But yeah, I did that. But guys, I need to talk to you guys about something. I need to talk about nutrition. Do you wanna know why I need to talk about nutrition? Because, you know, I feel like lately I've been kinda of off my game. So I feel like all of us together can get back on our game and, you know, stay on the road to healthiness because your girl needs it right now. It's hard when you have people in town and, you know, sometimes you just need a little bit of guidance as to, you know, a little something to hold you accountable. Because when you have friends over or you're hanging out with people, it's hard to eat healthy because you just want to chill and food is a social thing. So we just got to learn to create healthy habits. So I'm really excited because I just dropped my new nutrition program on my website. So the difference between this and the transformations is this is solely nutrition. It's only talking about food. It really just gives you a lot of insight on what's healthy for you and how to create healthy habits and to hold you accountable you can type in your food it gives you options of what's best to eat so i wanted to ask you guys what nutrition means to you like what what does nutrition mean to you i'm going to type it into the comment section and pin it what does nutrition mean to you <laughs> Okay, and I'm always really bad at pinning, pinning things, because it just never lets me pin it. But I'm gonna get there. Ah, got it. Okay, what does nutrition mean to you guys? I wanna, I wanna know everyone's take on the definition of nutrition. In terms of food. Obviously, healthy mind, healthy body, but in terms of food, what does nutrition mean to you? Nutrition means feeling good inside and outside. I agree. Nutrition is a balance of mindful eating. That's a great one. Mindful eating. Macronutrients and calories? Yes, somewhat. Calories aren't always nutrition. People, you gotta answer the question, but good on the people who are answering the question. Those are really good. What does nutrition mean to you? I feel like some people are like typing, so it takes them a while to get their answers out. I know when I get asked a question, I type like a really detailed message. Feeding your body and soul, that's good. Competition status? No, no competition. Sam had to go home. She she's going to uh go she went back to LA and she's gonna hang out with some friends and family. Mental health leading to physical strength. That's nice. What does nutrition mean to you? Well, I'll tell you what nutrition means to me. 
For me, nutrition means I am giving my body everything that it needs, not everything that it wants. Nutrition means that you're creating a strong energy source for your body so that you can fuel it, but you're not eating excessively where you don't really need all those extra things. You know, that, that quote of a moment on the lips, forever on the hips, it's a real thing, guys. It is a real thing. And I'm not saying that every once in a while you can't live your life and treat yourself, but in terms of having a nutritional diet, you need to make sure that you're getting all spectrums of the food, the food pyramid, right? You have your proteins, your veggies, your fruits, your grains, and it's really important to eat a lot of vegetables. I know it's really hard, but veggies are really good sources of energy. They're low in calorie, but they have so much nutrients and then they have so many vitamins and other things that are great for your body and your digestive system. So that's why I want you guys to check out this nutrition program because it really just gives you a lot of insight on what you really need. Because a lot of times we think we need more than we do, but we don't, you know? And sometimes you just need a, a little guideline. Okay, I have one more question. I'm gonna unpin this. How do you unpin? Unpin. I am now gonna ask, what do you guys struggle with? Because we all know we have our struggles. In terms of, in terms of eating and nutrition, what do you guys struggle with? I'm gonna type it and I'm gonna pin it. Oh, someone answered the last question. They said, nutrition plays an important role, important part in losing weight, getting leaner, and lowering body fat, not only looking good, but feeling good as well. That is true. Struggle with cutting out cheese. My brother has that same problem. And I've kind of started to develop that problem. I used to hate cheese. I didn't eat cheese, and now I'm starting to like it, and I don't know if I like that I like cheese now. I struggle with not not so much I struggle so much with not eating heavy things. Yeah, heavy things kind of lower your energy. Do you guys know like when you feel the itis? When you feel the itis and you're like, "Oh, I could take a nap right after this meal." That's usually not a good sign, but sometimes meats and heavier things like that take a little more time and more energy to digest. So that's why when you eat meats, you feel fuller for longer. Trying to slow down on oily foods. Yeah, that's a hard one. Ice cream? Hey, I don't blame you. That's a hard one. Following, following a diet plan and keeping consistent with it. Yes, that is very hard. But if sometimes I like to preface it a little bit differently in my mind. I don't really call my eating habits a diet anymore. I call it a lifestyle. So eating healthy for me isn't a diet, it's a lifestyle. And then I get to treat myself every once in a while rather than being like, oh, I have 10 days to lose X amount. I just want to be more consistent. And I know that's hard. Consistency is very hard, but it's definitely something we all need to practice. <laughs> Jade's nutrition is the secret to her abs. Yes, fits me it. It is true. Your stomach usually is a result of your food and your and more of your diet side of things, the more nutrition side of things. You can do as many crunches as you want, but it's not gonna give you that lean cut look you're getting you're trying to go for with your stomach. Training your arms is hard? Yes, it is very hard. I have nice hair. Oh my gosh, thank you. I thought my brother got all the good hair hair jeans, but I guess you think I got them too. You just you struggle with McDonald's? Fast food is a very hard thing because it's so convenient and cheap. So that's the hard thing is having a better nutritional diet is more expensive and more time consuming. But I promise you, if you guys sign up for my nutrition program, there are secrets to make it easier. My hair is getting longer. Thank you. People are coming in my hair. Yes. And it's up in a ponytail. I, I feel it, guys. Thank you. Um, yeah, last year when I was on set, they accidentally chopped off my hair to like a bob. Yeah, I, that went over really smoothly. <laughs> my hair grows so slow. Candy. I understand candy, especially around Halloween season. Uh, 
what do you guys struggle with in terms of nutrition? Trying to pin the comment again and it's really hard. Pin comment, there we go. Chips, oh my gosh, chips and salsa are my weakness, guys. I love Mexican food, any sort of Latin food, I'm just like all about it, beans, chips and salsa, fajitas, so I understand, trust. Usually when I do cheat and when I'm like going off the rails, chips and salsa are usually involved. <laughs> okay, I thank you guys for answering me. Soda, yeah, my, my dad has that problem. My mom kind of does too. Nachos. There comes the chips and the, and the cheese again. Mm, being picky is hard too, especially when you're picky about the healthy foods. But you kind of just got to train yourself to love them. I swear, I didn't like vegetables at all. But there's certain things that I now love because I just kept trying to eat them and changing my, you know, not really craving sweet things anymore. And when you eat healthier and cleaner, those bad habits kind of usually fall away because you don't need it as much. You realize you don't need it. Um, but I wanted to let you guys know the first people, first three people that sign up for my new nutrition program on my website will be tagged on my next self love post. You'll be right at the bottom. I'll put your names and your Instagrams in there. So if you guys want to be tagged, make sure that you go sign up for my nutrition program. It's different than my than my transformations. This is solely diet and nutrition. So if you guys sign up for that, you guys will be tagged in my next self-love post tomorrow. So if you guys wanna be get a little shout out on the gram, go and do that. It's the first three people we will be checking, so I suggest you do it quickly. <laughs> um, also, I just wanted to let you guys know, for those of you who have submitted a phone number, um, they will, you guys will be receiving a text message for $10 off for my nutrition program. So if you guys have already sent me your phone numbers, you guys will get a $10 discount for this new nutrition program. So look out for your text messages. I will be saying hey and giving you some bonus money. $10, yeah. But yes, thank you guys so much for talking and, and doing that with me. And I'm actually going to be doing this with you guys because I feel like I have had so many friends come and I've been justifying the bad eating habits. But we both, we all need to get on it together. We're going to create healthy lifestyles. We're going to feed our bodies the energy that it needs, the correct energy, foods from the earth. Let's go veggies. We all love veggies. But I will see you guys soon. Thanks for joining me and be sure to go and Sign up for my nutrition program so that you guys can get a little shout out on my Instagram tomorrow. I love you guys and I will keep this live up if you ever need to refer to it again.